On December 25, 2021, NASA launched the James Webb Space Telescope. This international $9 billion project was decades in the making and will give us an unprecedented look at the universe. What did the first galaxies look like? How do supermassive black holes form? Can we find signatures of life beyond Earth? These are just a few things that JWST will tell us. I'm Dr. Sabrina Steerwalt, an extragalactic astrophysicist here at OXY, and I'm also in one of the groups that was awarded the privilege of using this telescope first. JWST will observe the universe in infrared light, which goes beyond the optical light we can see with our eyes. Optical light is only a small fraction of the light that's out there. So when we observe the universe with optical telescopes, like our old standby, the Hubble, we're only getting a small piece of the picture. To observe in the infrared, we need to have larger telescopes to get the same level of detail as we do with optical telescopes. And infrared light, most of it, is blocked by the Earth's atmosphere, so we have to put infrared telescopes in space. The JWST mirror is so large that it had to be folded to fit inside the launch rocket. When unfolded, the gold-plated mirror is over 21 feet in diameter. So thanks to the supersized mirror and updates in detector technology, JWST can see details 20 times better than before. This new precision is like if we're looking at an image of a city. Before, an entire city block was just one pixel. And now we can see that that city block is made up of houses and there's a car there. Our group will be using this new improved precision to observe the dusty centers of galaxies and the intense starbursts and black holes that inhabit them. These dusty nuclei hold key pieces of information as to how galaxies like our own formed, but we know very little about them because we haven't been able to see through the dust that enshrouds them until now. I have the best job in the world. I get to ask questions about the universe and then try to answer them.